Hello, you're watching Arsenal Nation Live. I'm Kenzie Benali and this is Teammates. And today we are joined by these guys, Aaron Ramsey, Carl Jenkinson and Henrik Mkhitaryan. Great to have you guys here. So I'm going to ask you a series of questions about your teammates and all you're going to do is tell us the answer and then we're going to have a chat about them. So your first question is this. Who out of the three of you makes the most noise in the dressing room? Henrik's got it down already. Carl sorted. I'm going to ask you to tell me why you've picked these people as well when we turn them around. So on the count of three, if you want to show us your boards. One, two, three. Okay, interesting. So you've kind of technically got two votes there. You've gone for yourself. Tell us why you've picked these people. Yeah, like it was never going to be Jenko. I Keeps himself to himself and uh, gets on, gets on with the work. But so I always knew it was going to be out of me or Mickey. But yeah, I, I would have gone with Mickey. And Carl, you've gone for Aaron. Yeah, I feel like you have constructive things to say. And he's not, you're not loud, but he's always got good information or um, things to say. So yeah, that's why I put Rambo. And I think myself because. Carl is the quietest guy in the team. <laughs> 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 he never talks. <laughs> Rambo, well, I think sure. in between me and Rambo, I, I, speak, I speak more than, than him. I like to talk to my teammates, make some noise and, yeah, it'd be funny. Okay. Right, well, your next question is, who is the smartest player you've ever played with at Arsenal? In Arsenal? Yes. So it can be any of your teammates. Aaron's got his down. I reckon we'll put the same. Yeah. yeah. Right, well, let's find out. If you want to turn your boards around in three, two, one. Yeah, you guys have both gone for the same. Why have you picked um, I've gone with Czech. Uh, you know, he's, uh, yeah, he's quite intelligent. I think he can speak a lot of languages and uh, he takes full advantage of that as well. So, um, <laughs> so yeah, I, I would say him. I think he's experienced a lot in life and, um, yeah, and has taken advantage of where football's taken him and, um, yeah, learned a lot of uh, different languages, different cultures and stuff. So, Carl, do you agree with that? Yeah, the language thing was the main one. He would just speak to the boys in different languages all the time. Like if we're sat at a dinner table, we'd be speaking one language and speaking the next. So it's very difficult, I know from school, to learn different languages. So uh, it's quite impressive actually, yeah. Intelligent guy. Yeah, I would yeah. quite agree with them if it's off the pitch, but I'm talking <laughs> about being in the pitch. So I would say Mesut and Rambo because there are players that you will always get the ball to them and they will do like the, the smartest steps on the pitch. How do you feel about that, Aaron? Oh, thank you, Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that. You made his day. Actually, Mickey's the uh, most intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> it's too late, Rambo. <laughs> <laughs> OK, your next question. It's the middle of the night. You've got an emergency. <coughs> Which teammate do you call? <laughs> Is it out of us? Is it out it of us? It can be any teammate. Any teammate. <laughs> oh, my God. Who do you call? Um, Jenko hears a noise. He's... <laughs> Panicking. So, Carl, you're a bit of a worse. Uh, no. <laughs> so, say, say, Aaron, you're not choosing Carl. No. Um, <laughs> you sorted down the end yeah, there, Very quick. Aaron's struggling on this one. Okay, if you want to turn your boards around in three, two, one. <sighs> Interesting. Uh, for so why have you guys picked Socrates? Well, first of all, because uh, he lives next to me. <laughs> <laughs> he can be around straight away. Yeah, and secondly, I know that uh, if I call him very urgently, he will come and uh, see me or help me with the problem I have. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, I think Papa would just turn up and do what needs to be done with his stern face and just <laughs> deal with the situation. Um, so, yeah, I would... Uh, I'd give Papa a ring. I mean, I went for uh, Koscielny. <coughs> I think, yeah, he's our captain. And 
Yeah, he looks after the whole team and he's a tough guy as well, so I think you could rely on him to come and give you a hand. Yeah, both pretty tough guys, aren't they? Right, well, your next question is, out of the three of you, who is most likely to become a manager after you retire? What does the smile on your face mean, Mickey? A look deep in thought there, Carl. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm sorted. <laughs> Okay, so we'll turn the boards around in three, two, one. Aaron, two votes there. I'm not going into management, I don't think. Never no. say never, but I'm not. My only reason is I think you, you always look good in a suit. <laughs> that was the only reason I thought, yeah, Rambo on the touchline with the nice suit on. Look the business. Don't know about the rest of it. But. <laughs> yeah, that's, that that was what I was thinking as well. Oh. Especially when I've seen him two days ago with the you know with the coat, oh, yeah, 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 <laughs> well yeah. dressed, and I said, yeah, Rambo can be the head coach. <laughs> well, speaking of dressing well, kind of links into our next question. In thirty years' time, out of the three of you, who's going to look the best? Out of three us. <laughs> It depends if we still have money. <laughs> 30 years later. Who's going to look the best? That's a very strange question. Uh, and you can absolutely vote for yourself, by the way. I will be honest this time. I've been unhonest the rest. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tough one, Carl. I don't know. It's a bizarre question, to be honest. But... <laughs> Put you on the spot. Right, back. if you want to turn your boards around in three, two, one. <laughs> Mickey, you got for yourself. You think you're going to look good in 30 years? I think yes, because I already have in my mind how I'm going to look like. Well, tell with, us with a bit you... of grey hair, hair, you know, like <laughs> very nice dress. It's like Classic. a fine wine. Yeah. It's better with age. So you think you'll look good as a silver fox? I'm like a wine as older I get, as better I am. <laughs> Absolutely. Which is for Jenko. I've gone for Jenko. Jenko. I think. Yeah, he has a go most days. He's very he well has a dressed. Go most days. He's very well Cheers, dressed, um, and I think he will look after himself. Yeah. Cheers. Whereas me, on the other hand, yeah, <laughs> I don't look good, does he? Yeah. <laughs> oh, we'll come back fall to off that. The wagon, we'll come back to that in thirty years and have a little discussion. Um, next question: Who out of the three of you trains the hardest? Okay, so I think you're almost all there. So if you want to turn the boards around and... Oh! Sorry, I just couldn't seem to write two letters there. There we go. Right. If you want to turn your board around in three, two, one. Okay. So you got two votes, Carl. You did vote for yourself. <laughs> Why is that? Yeah, because oh, I, just, uh, <laughs> I, just, uh, I just think I train hard, yeah. So. To be fair to him, yeah, he's, like, he's been unbelievable. You know, and uh, he gives a, his absolute all every training session. But I've gone with Mickey as well because Mickey's a great professional and he, he gave me a, a little uh, little boost early as well. So <laughs> I think I'm due to giving one back. So, yeah, um, yeah, Mickey gives everything he trains to win. <laughs> OK, well, out of all of your teammates, who should not be allowed on the microphone at karaoke? Have you all heard each other sing? No. I'm trying to think who I've heard sing. Anyone sing on the team bus, sing in the showers? Right, so if you want to turn around your boards in three, two, one. So that's interesting. You oh, both, yeah. <laughs> Matteo. Yeah, like I said, he likes to sound his own voice, and uh, uh, it, like when he's, this song was terrible, <laughs> terrible. But um, yeah, he's not short of confidence, that boy. <laughs> so. he but to get attention, yeah, yeah, he likes to get tone. attention doing some like yeah. weird noises, you know, and singing like very weirdly. But I think I'm going for him without any doubts. <laughs> okay, so no karaoke for Matteo. Uh, guys, that's all we've got time for on Teammates. Thank you so much for joining us. And don't forget, you can join us every match day on Arsenal Nation Live. <laughs>